Hello guys, welcome to Vlogmas day 18! It's almost ending! Six Vlogmas, days. Yeah, Vlogmas is almost ending! Today we are in Prague! Still in Prague! And we are going to have lunch! And we are going to a special place in my heart! It's Pizza Hut! And I love Pizza Hut! And in Spain, in Barcelona, there's only one Pizza Hut, I think! And it's not good! We have tried and we didn't like the dough and in Portugal I always loved going there so we are going today and you know what is really good in Pizza Hut? Profiteroles! I love them! So yeah, I'm really excited to go there! and now we are waiting they don't have profit rolls I really want it I'm really sad I don't know if it's a Portuguese thing but I thought they would have profit rolls everywhere I don't know <laughs> probably it's a Portuguese thing I don't know tell me in the comments if in your country they have profit rolls in Pizza Hut wow they're actually baked potatoes they were made in the oven I saw them picking them up it's not as small as I thought. Yeah, it's, it's, nice. it's okay, yeah. Garlic bread, because we love garlic bread, potatoes, and the pizza. Okay. You could choose from these two types, like chicken wings and there's well, a, another what type we of, have. There's another type of garlic bread that you can order. Uh, yeah, only, only garlic. No, it's garlic, but with like mushrooms. Oh, and, uh, yeah, with, with toppings. Yeah, with toppings, but you have to pay extra for that. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. There's eight Morning slices. Morning Your house. They are really good. Is it good? Yep. Mine candy shop. <laughs> it's really cool. Oh my god, this is incredible. It's so cool. Who had the idea? Wow, silver. Yeah. We came to this bridge where you have a lot of people. There's a lot of people here walking well, and taking pictures. Yeah, that's because it's beautiful. Yeah, between 4.05 and 4.15 comes a guy with like... Something to light up the gas lamps. This type of lights that you have 
throughout the bridge. This only happens in December from the 1st, I suppose, until well, Christmas. It's cool, it's cool, it's a good tradition. We want to come, but I don't think it's going to be today, but tomorrow we'll try to be here because we have other things to see <laughs> and it's getting, well, the sunny setting. Can you see the light? It's so beautiful. <laughs> Under the bridge, there's a mini Christmas market with some stalls, like four or five six stalls. Well, actually, we decided to come today because it's already time, so yeah, yeah, I think it's literally starting now. And we were just under the bridge, so it was like two minutes to come back. Someone gave food to the seagulls and now they are crazy. Okay, he's coming. He's coming. And so many people are coming with him. Oh God. Well, we are under the light. <laughs> now we are one of those people, but we don't want to. <laughs> we just need to go in that direction. We are trying to leave. <laughs> So basically we are in the parks area, you have a lot of parks here because it's getting dark, probably we won't see all of them but yeah, we are going to walk, see what we can see We have penguins Penguins? There's penguins Where? Penguins? Oh! <laughs> okay, they're not real <laughs> This is like for the boats not to hit the wall, I suppose, right? I don't know that boat that just turned around. What is this? Are these ants or babies? Or aliens. Aliens, oh my god, yeah, because of the, the head. Baby aliens? Baby aliens ants? <laughs> because they are black. What? They are punched? I got, pun I got stepped in the face. What? I'm so confused. So we are on the other side of the river and here you almost don't see a tourist which is really cool because we can just walk freely Now we tried to go to a church that there is here but you need to pay And you know, we don't pay for churches Every church so far has been free as well so this one, I don't know why you pay This is the church on the outside This is the wall have arrived to the castle to the nice uphill <laughs> This is the square where it used to be a Christmas market that this year it was closed I don't know why but they just decided to close it and I think it was or it used to be the best one in Prague or at least the biggest one yeah the biggest one because there's more space here than the other square yeah now we came inside the castle you can see the stars from here can you see oh my god these are stars This is the cathedral, it's huge, it's enormous. 
it's gigantic. Gigantic. More it's so, synonymous. It's so detailed actually, like look yeah. at everything. Look at that part over there on the right side. And here, look. And everywhere. It's really cool. And it's a nice contrast with the buildings around, which are like clean. Look at the gold details. And the one on top as well, like. And the clock. And the oh, clock. they have two clocks. It oh, has two they clocks. Have, they have two clocks. Wait, the other clock? Oh, the other clock is similar the to the other one. It's the sun and the moon as well. Yeah. Here in the same place, in the same area, you have this cathedral, you have the castle, you have a basilica, a basilica and a palace. And a palace. We're going to see now the basilica, I think, or the castle. Now we are going to have dinner in a restaurant that is very spooky. It's the first tavern open in Prague, so we supposedly, are going there. Yes. Supposedly. Well, in yeah, we don't know, we don't know, obviously, but that's what we read. We are going there, we are going to have dinner, we are going to see how it is inside. We know that it's kind of spooky. spooky. <laughs> medieval. What is this? Fire? Yeah, that's the but show. We forgot to mention that you can also have dinner while watching a show yes, it's, inside. It's 10 euros a person and also they have accommodation, by the way, upstairs, which I do not know if it's medieval accommodation. Or just a normal one, yeah. yeah. But they also have it, so it's like a full package sort of thing. Yeah. They also have a buffet if you want to try a lot of things. So it's they have a lot of options to have longer or shorter experiences. Mm -hmm. So let's try it. Let's go inside. I'm curious to see how it is. So, oh gosh. You know? I'm scared. Can you open for me? Welcome to medieval times. Oh, it's fur. It's good. Look at this, <laughs> so cool. Skulls. I'm literally scared. A hand comes up out of nowhere and grabs me. This is Daniel's dish. Sorry for the noise. It's smoked pork ribs with mustard and horseradish. Oh, the sauce is mustard. Okay. And horseradish together. This is my dish, looks really good. It's chicken, mushrooms, potatoes, garlic sauce, corn, uh, I don't know, and this is plum sauce. The green is what? I don't know, it's not on the menu. Time to eat! It smells really good. Okay. What should I eat first? The potato, the safer <laughs> Normal potato. Plum sauce. How is this garlic sauce? Exactly. Exactly the same as the one we ate in the other in Vienna. What? Ketchup. Is that plum sauce? Ketchup. I swear it tastes the same. It's 
It's almost the same. Yeah. Mm. The skin is good. The mushrooms are like one mushroom. <laughs> now, the thing I don't like, I don't like corn. So let's eat the corn. How do I eat this? Out of the restaurant, what did you think? It was a wonderful experience. The food was excellent. It was not a tourist trap. But we ate a lot. <laughs> we ate quite a bit. I think 700 <laughs> grams of ribs. He thought it would be mostly bones. You know, but there was quite a quite a lot of meat. But it was excellent. Like it was very good. I loved it. It was. But even for what it was, it was not expensive. We paid 36 euros. So 36 yeah. euros for that amount of food is not expensive. You know, we paid 36 euros for hot dogs <laughs> to put it to put in perspective. To put in oh perspective. my god! <laughs> for the same price, look at what we got. Yeah, it was. A nice it was better. Yeah. Music, you know, people were role playing. The waitress would slam your beer into <clears throat> the table, like uh, like medieval. Mm -hmm. um, and if you wanted to, she could call you names like peasant or something really? like that. Yeah, it was written. I didn't on the understand. Menu. Oh. Uh... Okay, okay. Yeah. So you could role play with her. Like, if you got in the mood of medieval, she would also like call That's you cool. either knight or peasant. That's so funny. Just cool. Kind of scary as well. I liked my food. I didn't like the corn. So Daniel ate my corn. One thing we didn't understand was the show because you needed to pay 10 euros more for the show but I think it's just for them to go to your table and not for you to see the show because if you're there you can see the show so we could see a little bit and here it was cool we couldn't even, yeah we couldn't even see like if we wanted to go to the bathroom they were just there and yeah, we could yeah. watch so it was sort of weird I don't know if there was a specific place or something there was like an extra show that was more in depth but there was still music all around so you don't have to pay to enjoy it yeah i liked it i just don't understand why they were singing spanish but <laughs> but that's okay it was cool and yeah this was our experience in a medieval tavern i was making a joke before that imagine i tell her oh tonight we're gonna have dinner by the candlelights you know all romantic together <laughs> and then i take her to a restaurant that has candlelights but you're eating underneath skulls so romantic <laughs> i'm sure for some people it is <laughs> not for me <laughs> but a date is a date a date is a date <laughs> now we are going back through the same bridge So guys, I think I'm going to finish the video now. We are going home, we are tired. So if you like the video, don't forget to give your thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the notifications if you want to see every time I upload the video. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow.